my channel. In today's video, I am talking about 10 products that have been gifted to me through PR that I love. So these are products that have really solidified their place in my beauty routine. I either reach for them daily or I reach for them weekly, but I am constantly using these products. These are products that I've either repurchased or that I will repurchase when I run out of them. So I'm excited to share these with you. I'm also excited because this video is in collaboration with my friend Marnie Goldberg. Marnie is here on YouTube as Miss Gold Girl. She probably doesn't need an introduction because you guys are probably familiar with her channel already. Marnie has been doing YouTube for, I want to say, like eight or nine years. I don't know if it's been 10 yet, but it's been quite some time. She started YouTube in the very beginning when YouTube channels were very different than they are today. And uh, Marnie and I just got to know each other this year. And what I love about Marnie's channel, so I've been, like I said, I've been watching Marnie's channel for a couple of years before I even got to know her as a friend. And after getting to know her, I love her channel even more because Marnie really is the real deal you guys like she is the real deal what you see on YouTube is like the person that she is outside of YouTube and um, you know when I went to that reward stock conference in April you know I felt like um, I didn't know anyone that was going, you know, it was my first year to go to be invited. Like I really felt like the new girl at school, you know, that had no friends that just was like, Oh, can I sit with you guys at lunch? Like, I just felt that, you know, it was just a little intimidating to me. And, um, I reached out to Marnie and we weren't friends yet. I just shot her an email and said, Hey, I'm going to this. Will you be going? Cause I'd seen her videos in years prior that she always went. And you guys, like she really made that whole experience for me. Like she welcomed me, um, the whole trip. Like she included me and invited me to everything on that trip and I just really made the whole experience so much better because you go to these things and you know like there's like a select group of people that this is their first year to go but then for the majority these are people that go year after year that know each other that have their groups of friends and it's not like people aren't friendly people are totally friendly but you're not gonna walk up to like a group of like ladies sitting there chatting and just be like hi you know and just sit down and kind of like interject yourself into that conversation so if I didn't have Marnie there to like include me in everything and invite me to the dinners that she already had plans with friends which she did so graciously do like if I didn't have that experience the whole experience would have been completely different for me so I was just so grateful for her for doing that and um, I just I just adore her like she's always there when I have a question or I need a sounding board I can pick up the phone or shoot her a text and you know we'll talk for an hour and I really just adore her as a person she's also a mother she has two boys a uh, college and a senior in high school and um, I really admire her as a mother and as a wife I think that she's a great person and I'm really uh, thankful for her friendship so so anyway I feel like I have gushed a ton before we get started I also want to mention that um, it was kind of funny how this idea got brought up I had been thinking about doing this video for a little while and Marnie and I had been talking about doing a collab for like six months and just never could kind of pull it together and make it happen and so I shot her a text about a week ago and I was like hey I have an idea like I'm gonna do this topic you should do it too it'd be fun I think people would enjoy it um, well then the next day I was chatting with Reese and Stephanie and I told them hey I'm doing this collab with Marnie and this is the idea we're doing and Reese was like oh my gosh that's the video that I just uploaded today and I was like oh my gosh what are the odds so I'm gonna link Reese's video down below because I think it's so fun and I think that if you like you know obviously this topic you definitely want to check hers out too because hers is linked down below all right you guys that was probably the world's longest introduction let's get started okay so the first product I'm gonna share is actually the product that I've had the longest and this was sent to me by Derm store probably two years ago three years ago it's the Foreo this is a facial cleansing device if you've been following my channel for um, I don't know a couple of years you know that this is one of my favorite facial tool devices this is actually the one that I use daily um, I love this you probably know what this is but if you're not familiar with this this basically is something that you can use to assist the cleansing of your face so I um, squeeze my um, cleanser on this and and I completely submerge this in the water, get it wet, you turn it on, it vibrates, and then you literally just kind of gently like rub it and scrub your face with it. It feels so good. It really makes uh, my skincare routine something I look forward to. I used to always dread doing skincare in the evenings because I was so tired, uh, but I really, really enjoy There's actually a couple of products that have really made um, not only a difference on my skin, but they've made my whole skincare routine more enjoyable. So this is definitely one of them. It comes in different sizes. I want to say this one is $1.99 or something. There's like a smaller one that's $100. I think there's a $150 one and there's a $200 one. And I want to say this is the $200 one. I could be wrong. I will link a few different options for you down below though. So the next two products, two and three, are both by Maylove. You guys, I love these products. They are so amazing. And they are $28 each. 
Um, I cannot sing them praises enough. I've talked about them a ton. I know that there's a stock issue sometimes on them, so I kind of hesitated putting them in this video just because I know that it's been hard to get your hands on them. They sell out, then they restock, and they sell out. But I could not, I felt like doing this video, uh, I would not be... I would not be honest if I did not include these because these, you guys, are freaking amazing and I love them. It's the Night Renewer by Maylov. Maylov. <laughs> Maylov. I have an accent. It's the Night Renewer by Maylov. It's a glycolic acid cream. So I use this. I've worked myself up to about four times a week with this. Um, and when I use this at night, this serves as my moisturizer. So I cleanse my skin, I put on my eye cream, and then I put this on, and then I'm done. I don't add any moisturizer on top of this. This really does let your skin, it gives your skin this beautiful brightness this beautiful glow when I started using these products you guys I mean I clearly without a doubt notice a difference in the brightness of my skin um, I mean I've always used good skincare and I've always kept up with my skincare routine so um, you know I think I had a good starting point uh, so it's kind of hard sometimes when you try a new product to like really be wowed, right? Because I've already been using good products and taking care of my skin for a while. Uh, but these two products were like a wow product. Like I noticed a difference within, I mean really within about a week and I will not stop using these ever. Uh, the other product is their Glow Maker Serum. So this is their antioxidant serum and I use this every single morning. I cleanse my skin and I put this on dry skin and then I go in and apply the rest of my skincare in the morning. And this, you guys, has been a game changer for me as well. I absolutely love these products. I think I need to get more though because this is a how old is this I've had this for a little while I need to get another one of these and I hope I can get that I don't know if I will be able to okay another skin I have two more skincare products uh, the uh, rapid wrinkle repair cream by Neutrogena uh, I did a video I think it was back in April and it was the first time that I had tried the rapid wrinkle repair line I don't know why I have a hard time getting those words out uh, but you guys this is a super impressive nighttime moisturizer you guys for anti-aging that's drugstore very very impressed with this it's very thick and rich and emollient which is what I love Love. It really feels like a very um, intense nighttime treatment. Uh, they have one that's fragrance-free, and then they have this one, which has a pretty strong fragrance. So if you're someone that doesn't like a fragrance, I would opt in for the fragrance-free one. But it is just this really nice, rich souffle. This is actually my second tube. So I went through the one that was sent to me, and then this is the one that I have. So on the nights that I don't use the uh, glycolic acid cream by Mela, I am using this guy. I just think it's like I said. I mean, forget the price, forget the fact that it's drugstore, you guys. This is this rivals really any expensive nighttime cream that I would use. I love it. I love it. I love it. If you are looking for a good nighttime drugstore treatment or forget drugstore you guys seriously it's it's that good um, I highly recommend it so the last skincare product I have to share is by Colleen Rothschild and it's the clarifying detox mask now I feel like I could do a separate video just for products that I love by Colleen Rothschild seriously you guys when I went to the conference in April, they gave me kind of their best sellers, and I loved every single one of them. Um, and then recently, I received a package where I had some new products that I um, was gifted, and I've been trying those, and I like them too. I have yet to get a product by Colleen Rothschild that I dislike. Yes, there are some that I love more than others, but for overall, I would say the Colleen Rothschild brand is phenomenal. And I've never collabed or done a sponsored video with Colleen Rothschild. Like They've been generous enough to send me the product, but I've, but I've never officially worked with them. As far as like the brand in general, I have been really impressed with their all the products that I've tried. Um, I, it was hard for me just to grab one. You, I love the eye cream, I love the facial oils, I love the cleansing balm. Um, but this one, you guys, I think was the one that I picked just because, so it's a mask. So you can see, you put this on your skin at night, you let it dry for, I think it's 10 minutes. Is it 10 minutes? I feel like I leave it on for about 10 minutes. Yes, 10 minutes, two to three times a week. I don't use it that often. I really should because I will tell you, every time I use this, my skin feels so squeaky clean. It feels amazing. Like There's like this really nice, refreshing, tingly sensation that's happening when you have it on. It just really pulls up and lifts all those impurities and dirt and oil in the skin. And I mean, you wash your face and your skin feels cleaner than it's ever felt. Like, you know that you're getting it all out. Um, I need to up, the, I use this at least once a week. I should be using it more, but you know. Um, so I really, really, really love this. Okay, so moving on to a couple of makeup products. This lipstick by Sigma was sent to me a couple months ago, and I love it. It's the shade In Spades. This is kind of one of those go-to lip colors that I grab regularly. This is what it looks like. It's a really nice, rich, peachy pink pigment. 
It, uh, I like the consistency of it. It has a lot of color, as you can see. It's not a sheer lipstick. It has a little bit of a sheen, so it's not a matte lipstick, but it's certainly not glossy either. As far as wearability, because it is um, not super glossy and it's not sheer, it is going to stay on the lips really well. Is it a lipstick that you can eat and be fine with? No, it's not a liquid lipstick. It's definitely more hydrating than a li liquid lipstick, but I just really like the formula and I love the color. The color is just like perfect for me. I love this color. I wear this all the time. I reach for it. It's a color that I feel like I can wear when I don't have any eye makeup on, or it's also subtle enough to when I have a lot of eye makeup on, it doesn't really compete with the eye makeup either. You know what I mean? You know, sometimes when you wear a really bold or dramatic eye, you want to kind of tone the lips down. Um, and then when you don't have much on the eyes, you want to play the lips up a little bit. I feel like this is one of the few lipsticks that can go either way. It can be enough color when you don't have eye makeup on, and it can be not too much color when you have a lot of eye makeup on. It's just a really easy, like effortless color to grab and throw on and I love it. Okay, this eyeliner is by DHC, and this was sent to me by Derm Store a while back. I probably should replace it, um, but I love it. When I first got it, I kind of wasn't sure how I felt about it. I, I love the richness of the black. Like, it's a super extreme black. I love the little applicator. It's very flexible. Let me show uh, if you can see it right there, but it's very flexible, so it's nice and soft, and makes it basically makes drawing that wing liner really easy. When these pens are too stiff and you don't have enough flexibility with it, it's it can be a big mess, so I really love the flexibility. The one complaint I had in the beginning when I first got this, and I was kind of figuring out how I felt about it, is that uh, I felt like it transferred on the eyelid. So now what I do is I just put uh, my liner on, I keep it really thin, and I kind of just give it, I don't know, 20, 30 seconds, not a long time, but I just kind of give it that time to look down so that my eyelid doesn't fold and touch the top of my lid, and I don't have any problems with it smudging. It stays on, it's just really rich, and I like the application a lot. So this has become uh, pretty much my go-to. If you watch any of my and it lasts forever. Like I have not had to replace this yet and that's kind of actually questionable because I've had it for so long. So it lasts a long time. This brush by It Cosmetics, this is the Heavenly Luxe French Boutique Blush Brush number four. I love it. I love all of their brushes, to be honest. I haven't been gifted a lot of It Cosmetics brushes. This one and one other powder brush was sent to me, which I love that one too. I can't find it though, which makes me really sad. But I love this blush brush. I love the angle of it. It's perfect shape for the cheeks. It's so soft. When I am doing uh, cheek color, I want my brush to be really soft so that it doesn't pick up too much color and so that it blends it really nicely. So I love this. I love the shape. I love how it feels. It's just a really fantastic um, blending brush. I obviously won't have to repurchase another one. I shouldn't have to, but I will, but I would purchase this with my own money. Like if I lost this, I would go and repurchase it because I love it. It's one of my favorite blush brushes. And the last two products I have to share are by the same brand. It's by Miraness, and I'm so excited because I partnered with Miraness a couple of months ago to talk about this product right here, their thermal hair mask. And when they sent me this, they went ahead and sent me like a goodie package of like their makeup to try. So I've been trying that over the last few months, and I've really grown to love some of their products. Um, so let's talk about this already since I've given that away. But this is their thermal hair mask. Um, and I had never really used one of these at home before. Uh, when I tried this, you guys, it was one of those products with like within the first use I noticed a difference in my hair um, I mean immediately after rinsing it out and just feeling my hair it just felt so silky and so I don't know just so silky and conditioned and just oh, I loved it and then when I blow dried my hair it had this really nice like chic sleek look to it I have really thick hair and it's pretty coarse and it's very um, treated like I get highlights every six weeks I get keratin treatment so you know my hair puts up with a lot if um, I were to just totally air dry my hair without putting any product it would look really dry in my opinion and coarse this made my hair look like I mean it looked like a Pantene like pro V commercial. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to toot my own horn, but I felt like if I were to like do this, it would just like listen and like the, I just felt it, it felt and looked amazing. Um, so I have used this probably, I don't know, eight or 10 times since I started using this in the summer. Um, I try and do it like once every two weeks. I probably could do it more often, but really that's what I have time for because when you do this, you do have to put this on the hair and let it sit for like up to 20 minutes. I usually leave it on for like 10 to 15 minutes. Um, but I really, I have a video actually. I'll link the video down below if you want more information on these, but these are definitely something that I'm going to continue to replenish because they make that much of a difference. And then if it can give me that results with my hair, I feel like, I feel pretty confident saying that this will work on um, even the most damaged hair. So, so anyway, yeah, I'll leave more information on this down below if you want to check it out. 
And the last product, product number 10, is the Miraness Cushion Foundation. So this was sent when I received the thermal hair mask. It was just kind of, you know, like, here, try our makeup. Tell us what you think. And um, I love this foundation. I'm a pretty big fan of cushion foundations anyway, I think. Um, I've tried some others, and I've really liked them. Uh, I really like this one, though. It gives really nice coverage. I would say it gives medium, on, on the between medium and full coverage. But it has a very, like, natural finish. It leaves the skin, like, natural looking, like, not heavy or, um, it doesn't look heavy, it doesn't look cakey, it doesn't look flat or matte, but it's also not like super radiant either. Um, I would say it's kind of between radiant and natural. You know, it's somewhere in there. It kind of falls more to the natural spectrum. You know, you have radiant, you have natural, you have natural matte, and you have matte, right? And I feel like this finish is kind of somewhere between the radiant and the natural, but more on the natural side. Does that make sense? That's just kind of how I'm envisioning it. But really good coverage. It does have skincare benefits to it. Um, I was given three shades, and I gave my mom one. I gave her the lighter one, and she texts me the, like, two days later and was like, oh my gosh, I love it. It covers my age spots and it doesn't look, you know, too heavy on my skin. So um, that'll give you some idea, you know, of how it works on mature skin. I'm actually going to be doing a video um, with Miraness uh, probably sometime in the next uh, four to five weeks. And we're going to be using some of my favorite Miraness products. So look out for that. I know I did do a video with my mom. I think was that last year has it already been it hasn't been a full year but it was it's been a little while and I have so many requests to bring her back on my channel so I, I thought that would be a fun video to do so look out for that all right you guys that wraps up this video I hope you enjoyed it um, be sure and check out Marnie's video I will have it linked down below for you I am curious to see what products she picked because we didn't discuss like the only thing I do know is that she also has 10 products, but I have no idea which products that those are. So I'm excited to see that as well. Um, all right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, I hope you have a fantastic day, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.